Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome back to Evans Mom's Kitchen. Today my mom is going to make another delicious recipe and its name is Anda Chana Masala recipe. It is quite good and spicy. So let's begin this recipe without any delay. First of all, we're going to add oil in a saucepan and let it heat up normally. After that, we're going to add the freshly crushed cumin seeds in it and mix it well. Now, add the two chopped onions and fry until they get light golden brown color. Don't get them too much dark, otherwise they'll turn into black. Now, we're going to add the ginger garlic paste with the green chilies in it and again mix it well. Fry it until it's a good aroma spreads around everywhere. Then we are going to add a tomato puree or you can also cut a tomato into the small pieces and fry it for 2 or 3 minutes. Then you are going to add the half cup water and then try spices into it. We are going to add the salt, turmeric powder, red chili powder, black pepper powder and crime salt into it and then we are going to mix it well. After mixing it well, you're going to just cover it for a few minutes. After the cover is removed, then you're going to stir and cook it for a few minutes more so that the oil can be separated from it, as you can see over here. Then you're going to add the boiled chickpeas into it and again mix it well. Now you're going to add the green coriander and cook for a while. Now you're going to add a chickpeas water and cook it for a few minutes. Add some kasuri methi and dark kanerda in it and then mix it well. Now add some boiled eggs into it and cook on low flame for 10 minutes. So over here the chana masala is ready. It looks very delicious and spicy and with the coriander on it and the boiled eggs that enhances taste. Do try this recipe in your home and tell us in the comment box about the results. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.